This scenario sets the stage to explore the essential question of the SC2 competition. Can the top team's collaborative SC2 radios outperform the status quo of static allocation? Here's how this question is put to the test. In the baseline stage, as is commonly done today, teams are assigned dedicated, unique bands of spectrum to achieve their communication objectives. This walls-up mode represents the current state of the art, a static allocation approach that serves as a baseline for evaluation. Teams are then individually evaluated in a payline stage, where no spectrum restrictions are provided, and teams must collaborate to maximize use of the spectrum. This walls down stage represents SC2's future of an autonomous spectrum management paradigm. To receive a PE2 prize, the score of a team's payline stage must meet or exceed the score of its baseline stage, while not degrading the rest of the ensemble's performance. Should this occur, we will have witnessed autonomy outperforming humans at the task of spectrum management for the first time. Each of these teams, we gave them five attempts to pass the pay line, um, each attempt playing with a, a different ensemble. Um, we're now gonna show you each of those attempts. Let's jump right into it and let's bring up Team Zelenium. This is Team Zelenium's first attempt at the pay line. The ensemble out to a good strong start there right out of the gate, Ben. Oh, congratulations, Team Zelenium. That performance was awesome. We're gonna move to Team Marmot E. We're gonna look at their first attempt. All right, so Marmot E, Ben, is in yellow here for their first attempt at the and pay it's line. It's worth noting that teams can't score Whoa. early on, which is why you see that gap. Okay. Congratulations, Marmot E. You guys have made this look easy so far. Let's look at Team Sprite's first attempt here at the pay line. Okay, so we can see them come in in the middle of the band using a pretty sizable chunk of the spectrum, actually. Paul, with less than 40 seconds left as we play through here, unless something dramatic changes well, in the uh, way they're well, using the they're spectrum. Start, oh, I, they might have had it there. They were starting to climb up. With only a few seconds left, I... Unfortunately, not a pass on the first attempt. Let's keep going. Let's move on. We're going to move to Team Erebus. We're going to take a look at their first attempt. Ben, we, we saw a lot of matches with, with Erebus here earlier, and, and usually they, they're in these very narrow bands and they're sort of tucked in between other, other radio use. And yeah, you're right. They have huge blocks of spectrum. They're like everywhere here. I wonder whether this change in strategy from what we normally see held the ensemble back, Ben. But let's move on to Team BAM Wireless and take a look at their first attempt. Green, green everywhere. That's a lot of green. That is a lot of green. This a lot of green doesn't result in them getting a lot of green. BAM is struggling to actually capitalize and turn that into points. Oh, all right, let's move on to Team Gator Wings. The ensemble seems to be struggling to get back up to that baseline score. Gator Wings moving all over the board here. That looks like chaos. Let's look at Team Scatter's first attempt. Um, so trying to opportunistically use any gap in spectrum they, they can find. They've, they've crossed their pay line a couple times, but the ensemble, incredibly steady here, about 50% of what they need to be. Yeah, the ensemble Unless hovering. the ensemble pulls it together, no. Let's move on to Team Dragon Radio. It doesn't look like Dragon is I'm not scoring any points. I'm not seeing a single point out of Team Dragon Radio here, Ben. The rest of the ensemble has accommodated Team Dragon quite well, but just Dragon doesn't seem to be able to, to capitalize there on it. Team Sprite's second attempt at the pay line. We have Sprite in purple. Sprite here. is in purple. Whoa! Whoa! All right! speed record. I think you beat both Zelenium and Marmot E for time to the pay line. Next up in their second attempt, let's look at Team Erebus. Looks like Erebus is back to their usual yeah, strategy. Yeah, this is the strategy we expect to see, where they're they're very narrow, they're not a lot... Oh, whoa! And All right, they, so they're way over right now. Almost they're almost doubled their score there from the baseline. They're... they're uh, and it's just flirting with it. It's just flirting with oh, it. Come on! Come on. <laughs> Ben, I blame the ensemble. They're so close. No, come on. They're so, three, two, one, oh. zero. Oh. That, that looked like the ensemble held you back. Let's look at Team Bam Wireless's second attempt here. Different frequency usage pattern than we saw from Bam the first time. Looked like Bam actually changed they their did. strategy. They did, they changed their strategy. They're, they're, they're much narrower now, and they're kind of, I think they're doing a better job fitting and in the between the And the ensemble's doing better. It looks like I saw adaptation from you guys to accommodate and get the ensemble above the line, but, but I wasn't seeing Bam score the points we needed to see there. Team Gator Wings, let's look at your second attempt. And Once again, they're sensing. We saw this last time. That's right. They're, okay, they're quiet, so and they come on. And when they come on, they come on with a bang, Whoa. Ben. Less than a minute left in this 
in this pay line round. Oh, oh, yeah! Nice job. That was almost a buzzer beater there, Gator Wings. Yeah. Let's go to Team Scatter. Team Scatter is busily scattering about the spectrum. This is like a strategy. They're just going to try and shoot it in briefly, I think. <laughs> They're over. They're oh! over. Oh, they're, they're holding steady. Come on, if the ensemble can catch back up. But yeah, it doesn't look like it's going to pan out. Uh, yeah. Then we're going to visit Team Erebus, who got oh so close last time. Erebus, slowly but surely, like the tortoise, getting across the finish line. Now if oh, the ensemble oh, can oh, do oh, it! Hey. Nice job. Let's visit Bam Wireless's third attempt. Remember last time, Ben, we saw them for about half of the round. Uh, they were sort of wider in frequency use, and then they narrowed through, out. They narrowed down and yeah. seemed to do a better job estimating where the other teams were. For All right, there's Whoa. the shift. That looked like that helped the ensemble actually get over that, that it, finish it, line there, Ben. It did. They, they helped the ensemble, but they're, but, they're struggling but again, I'm not seeing Bam actually capitalize on that, that wise decision they made. And no. OK. Let's move to Team Dragon Radios. Third attempt. Back to their oh, old tricks again. here, Ben. Yet, yet again, Ben, you gotta wonder, is there something in the radio, some kind of make crash, a bug, a fault, so, something. Something went wrong, something, yeah. Something's not going right there for Team Dragon Radio. Team Scatter will look at their fourth attempt. So Scatter comes on, the ensemble falls back, but they're still doing pretty well. Still in the ballpark of where we need that ensemble. Yeah, so Scatter can figure out how to put more points on the board without. Uh, uh, oh. Oh. Kick it in there, it's Scatter. Less than a minute left, ball. So we'll go, oh we'll go to Nail Biters. They're, they're maintaining. Oh. No one's had a heart attack yet, right? Uh, we got everyone, it, everyone's still still. Ingrid seated. looked pretty close. We're going to go to Team Dragon Radio. Oh, we got some points briefly out of the gate there, just like we saw last time. We saw those couple of blips of points early on, but I'm not seeing it. All right, we're back, and we're gone. The ensemble yeah, here also similarly not able to get back to where they were. Final attempt for Team Bam Wireless. Paul, look at this ensemble. The, everyone else in this ensemble has passed. Uh, come on, Bam. Ooh. Great scores from the ensemble. We're at less than a minute left, Paul. Bam's taking a few shots on goal, Ben. Oh! oh! Come on! Oh! oh! Team Dragon Radio, where are you guys? One last attempt. Let's see it, guys. And they seem to be doing pretty well out of the gate. We see the ensemble is dragging. Oh, I really think something's just gone wrong with the radios. There's clearly some bug that we're seeing here. I oh! We've been through all of our pay line attempts. Congratulations to our pay line winners. Nice job, guys. <laughs> <laughs>